Hello, this is Bruce Dix with BD Live Sound and Studio and also Sound Engineer with Hopeful Baptist Church. Talking about the Soundcraft SI Impact Board, but I'm also just uh, going into a little EQing and uh, ringing out uh, system. So on the Soundcraft Impact Board, uh, to get to your main, which is right here with the on button right there, this is your main. If you select, then you can come down here to your highs and lows. And there's my highs. What it is, is you would like to cut instead of boost as much as you can, but you also want to keep it as flat as you can. You want the instruments to sound just as good and as clear and as they supposed to sound as you can. So if we're going to ring out a system, we can take a microphone, test one, two. All right, so I got my microphone there. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ring out the monitors on this system. Well, I'll just do the mains. We're gonna ring out the main on the system. There's my speakers up above. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna boost one of these frequencies right here. Test one, two. You can hear the difference. And then I'm gonna boost another one and another one and you can hear the feedback coming in. So then what I do is I take, and on uh, Android, Apple, it doesn't matter, I use a RTA, and you can usually either get them for free, or you can, uh, you know, purchase for two or three dollars. And what this RTA does, whenever you uh, have it downloaded, and it comes up, it'll show you all the frequencies that's in the room. So right now, that's what it's showing. So then what you need to do is you watch that, and then you pick up your mic, let me turn my mains back on because it was rattling already. Uh, and then what I do is I take it and you get it as high as you can. One, two. And then let it. All right. And you can see right there, let me turn that down a little bit. But you can see on the graph the lines that was uh, peaking. Let me do it again. All right, you see the big line right there? Okay, that'll show you what frequency it is. That is squealing like that. And then you would come to your board. And right now, that frequency is right here at uh, 5K. And I'd pull that down. And also uh, 6.3K, because I had both of those boosted. Now I'll pull my mains back up. One, two, one, two. And see, I have no, no ring. I'm still at the same low as I was before. And look at the graph, there's no spiking. One, two, one, two, test. One, two. And what you do is you just go through when you get your board, just go ahead and make everything on your board flat, which is be the way it, it usually comes, and then adjust uh, using the ARTA, showing the spikes and pull them down and cut them. And then listen and make sure you have uh, the sounds as of that you are desiring. One, two, one, two, test, one, two. See, I put it back, everything's fine. It was just those two frequencies that I had boosted on my EQ that went ahead and made that squilling. So I hope this helps. And uh, I guess that's it. So y'all have a great day.